Hey you right guys, Trish Munch is Joe here, and today we are watching and reacting to episode 11 of One Tree Hill Season 5. The last episode was Peyton chatting with Mia. What else happened? <laughs> no, we had Nathan uh, obviously fucking up kind of with Haiti, and then Jamie falling into the pool. We had Dan almost going out on parole and Lucas finding out that Nathan had visited him. So it was uh, it was the best episode we've had in a while, I'd say, to be fair. And hopefully we can just keep up that pacing because, like I said, we've had some stinky storylines. Again, it's not even so much the storylines, it's just the likability of the characters has been stinky ass for quite a few episodes. And Payne and Lucas didn't redeem themselves last episode, so I guess you could argue that still is the case. I just felt like there was less of them and about them being knobheads constantly last episode so it's probably more enjoyable but yeah episode 11 guys if you enjoy remember to leave a like if you're new remember to subscribe and if you do want the early and uncut reactions to one tree hill then link to patreon page will be in the description and one of the comments down below by the time this one's on youtube patreon should be on season seven not sure what episode but it will let you know exactly which episode down below but for now let's do this Lindsay, that one's true. Will you marry me? Lindsay, I just kissed my ex, who I'm still madly in love with, but will you marry me? Because I'm an idiot. I want a divorce. Oh, uh, yeah. This is great. No, Haley, No. <laughs> if Nathan had dunked the kid in the pool and killed it, then yeah. I mean, he'd be going to prison. It'd be more than a, than a divorce. I think maybe it's an impulsive thing. I don't know. I just don't see it as like... Maybe she, because she probably still sees it as Nathan cheated on her. I'm curious what everyone else would think on this storyline. Throwing a bachelorette party when her marriage is struggling. Ah, is it bachelorette party time? In the same place a girl like you happened to have her party. Nathan and Haley would have to talk. Ah. Nice. You could do that on any other night. Why do it on your bachelor party and bachelorette party, or whatever the word for that is. I don't actually know the name of it. So. You want to be bad with me? No, I do. You know Lucas being bad is just doing missionary. That's all that's all Lucas being like, ah, oh, a bit risky. Okay, look, I want bacon on pancakes. Oh my god. Like that she it, looks so nice. When's Daddy coming home? Yeah, you know he's sad when even that won't cheer him up. Ah nice, nice. <laughs> it looks like Dan now with his mustache. Joint party? Man, your parents are messing up everything. <laughs> yes, skills. Well, I You're not wrong. To the hot tub. I love how we've not bought up that Jamie nearly died. No one's I mentioned that. Great pirate last weekend. You told me Tim rescued you, but you gotta admit that story seems a little far fetched. Tim, who has no friends. No? What do you mean to her again? Yes, over and over again, and like she called out her dead it. dad. Oh, Peyton, shut up! Wow. <laughs> that shot is like Lucas and Peyton in a nutshell, really, wasn't it? What about you and Mel? How's that going? Let's just say things are really good. Let's just say he won't shut up about. So sweet. I don't know. Every day he delivers How no woman likes him. And he's so sad. Oh, Hi. Ah, oh, go away. <laughs> you a pumpernickel bagel. Yeah. And a surprise for you. It's been so nice not having him in my life for like two episodes. Rachel's back. Rachel. Rachel. <laughs> Do you think I still oh, have a chance with her? <laughs> in my apartment. Uh, maybe he doesn't want people to know that, Brooke. Sure. The fuck? Seems okay today, Just tell everyone, I guess. Uh, she's picked up on the fact that he had a thing for Rachel then. Yes, oh, did he get... Is he out? Feels good to be back. I hope he says some shit like that. <laughs> oh, he's actually out. Thank God. You know what? I don't even care. Let him out. Murdered his brother in cold blood. And then blamed it on the local school shooter. And he's out. Yeah, sure. Oh, I love that little smile. Dance back in town. <laughs> that's what the name of this app should be. I don't care if that's not a song. I'll make it one. Does my store look like a drug run to you? It's the startup money you lent me for my label. I just got paid for me as deal. Jeez. Oh, a bunch of Colombians? No, but can it's just more fun. <laughs> it's more dramatic. Peyton, this... I wanted to check, though. What's going on? Um, Brooke? Ah. Schmaten. Not the time. When does Brooke do wedding okay, dresses, anyway? Hi. You make a very beautiful bride. Your Thank dead you. dad would be proud. <laughs> Skill okay, shopping right, with Jamie, Jamie, I love it. I don't know. Can we play rock and ads party? It's rock band. There you go. I have my answer. Oh, PDA in the mall is so seventh grade. 
<laughs> Kiss me, they're doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Look how much more chemistry these two have. Why did Owen have to have a shitty episode? O-M-G. Bevin! Lucas? I-B-E-N-S. Yes! Oh, let's go. Rachel, Dan, and Bevin. And Tim. And I had a little boy. Oh. Wait, what? You didn't marry skills? Is the cutest name is Nathan. Oh, no, boy, no, he didn't, but... Nathan? With wow, Tim? Is you marrying Brooke? Huh. With Tim? Oh, I thought she'd marry Peyton. Wait, so she had, is that the Lincoln? She had to be with Tim, is that what that is? What about skills? It's been hard on her, you know? So Does it give gross, you the ache when guys I, walk I like that? She's strong enough to stay sober. Really Question. Hope give me so answers. Okay. Hands in pockets. But not really, just, just the thumbs. You don't want to be too cool, but you don't want to be too formal, but you don't want to be too badass. Way over your head, you wouldn't have understood. Oh, God, go so, away. It's been nice not having her as well, anyway. but she I is a natural villain, so it makes sense. You're dismissed. Go play. It's what you do best. She needs to go soon. You shouldn't put up with that. Great. Victoria's back. <laughs> hey, 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 where's my kiss? Oh, <laughs> okay. Fucking sick jacket, Jamie. He's got style already. Prince is in town. So right. He's super cute. He's coming out with Luke is gonna, told him you were gonna shit be there. himself. So. I will go get ready, but he better be cute. <laughs> Fair enough. Super motivated to get back to work. Mm, and yesterday, bullshit. you know, you said that maybe bullshit. Start for clothes over bros again. So I feel like this is the time of the story where she starts hunting for more drugs. You know, like you could learn the retail side and and work your way back up. What do you think was gonna happen? Yeah, just go back. You've been in detox for like a day. I'm not gonna make those same mistakes. Yeah, bullshit. I'm strong. Mm. You said so. Yeah. I know. I know how storylines work. She's gonna rob Brooke. Brooke had that thick chunk of cash. Where's that gonna go? I wonder. Hmm. Is someone going to take it? It's so witty, Dan. Actually, it's for my grandson. Wow. I never would have guessed. Keep yourself in great shape. Fucking all right, Patty. What time do you get off? There's no way he's already trying to hit on people. Well, I mean, she hit on him, to be what fair. Time you gonna pick me up? Uh, maybe she's into guys who just look like they've just got out of prison and bed at the same time. I mean, I'd bring you along if I didn't think it was insensitive to her condition. Rachel's never been sensitive Wait, to anyone's condition but her own. What's she on, what's she on about? Well, you don't know her like I do. Uh, you don't know her that well, Mouth, to be fair. You know her well, but not as well as I do. Like, what's that? It's okay, Mal. Just go. I mean, just, it's I'll see you at the party. You can't be salty as well. I don't even agree with her. Uh, <laughs> I just had to do that noise, sorry. Sometimes you just got to do a sound effect just to get it out of your system. Hi, Owen. Hey. Hi. Oh, fuck off. Wow. Wow. Brooke. We're bringing everyone back in one app. It's about time. You know what? I'm, I'm here for it. I won't say they exactly have bought Bevin back. I think she just had one moment. As did Tim. Clean team chase. Oh my god. Wow. Is so good. He's actually sure back in the show. I thought he was really done. Are you two enjoying this? How oh. can you not? It's kind of funny. Yeah, a little. Okay. Well, you're paying. Fine. And you've just shown Rachel where the money is. Okay. Somebody want to tell me what's going on? Uh, hey, bud. There we go. Big reveal. What the mm. uh, fake virgin check? You lost your virginity too. <laughs> God. Yeah. What about her? Do you remember her name? <laughs> oh, it's hitting him. <laughs> it's hitting him. There we go. Come <laughs> on. That's great. That TV, however, is not so great, but <laughs> I thought that was Dan shredding on the guitar. Dan's were gonna walk in at the end of the episode. Wait, how long? Yeah, sure uh, maybe not. I, maybe I towards the end. Right this is a bachelor party. That's so depressing. <laughs> I'll give the show that. I really did hold off on just throwing everyone back in. Eleven eps to get Bevin and Chase and Rachel pretty much. No, what's this? What's this? You're not gonna try and hook up with mouth. Oh no, don't. I feel I don't know. We'll see. Yes, Jamie. What? If the kid wants to play Rock Band, it goes play because you literally. It nearly died fucking five days ago. Have we forgot about this? No one's mentioned it. It's quite. I know. Maybe later, okay? Skills. 
Skills. Skills, 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 come on. My boy! Oh, my baby is so cute! Oh, Skills is the cutest person in the world, I want to cry. I'm actually tearing up. Oh, that was the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Okay, I'm not gonna cry. I almost did. But Skills is the most adorable human, I love him. I basically had to sleep with my boss to keep my job. Oh, shut up, you penis head. How do you go from now? Skills to... I'd no probably still have my job if Brooke had that role. Well, is there anything I can do for you now, Rachel? Anything? Oh, no. Sure. Here we go. I could really use the release mouth. Little natural. Oh, my God. Rachel, I... Come on, you slept with your boss. How about a model? I can't. Why does everyone love math so much? Go of whatever it is, it makes you think you're not good enough. Because that's when you're going to beat this. Yes, math. It's an inspirational you know speech. I should go. Fair play. He didn't cheat on his girlfriend. Or are they together? I don't know if it's his girlfriend. Here we go. Trying to go steal the money. Call. Oh. Uh, go away, Carl. Can't be mad at math in that scene. Brooke and Skills are like the best parent. Like, Skills is Jamie's dad and Brooke's Jamie's mum. Let's just accept that now. <laughs> Those are the two people who love you the most in the world. No, Skills and Brooke love him the most. Kid. But they have better scenes with them than <laughs> Haley and Nathan. What's under all the clothes, Brooke Davis? Slowly find out. Nice. <laughs> Great. What the fuck? On that note, boy time is over. Let's go. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Okay, we're gonna fist bump that and then we'll just drop the mic, I guess. Pick the right person to spend the rest of your life with, Luke. So did you. Luke just loves doing that, don't he? Send a little line again, like a little side wink and then like a little, a little waddle off and then a little laugh. Oh, dude! I've been this song in ages! What the fuck? So this is kind of weird, huh? What the <laughs> fuck? That's just so... I've not that thought this song in like 10 years. Oh, but I was with Brooke. Chase him, Peyton? You still love him? Question mark, maybe. He's with Lindsay now. So, that's not his question. Really? Oh, okay. Oh, sure. Chase. Three o'clock. Lucas was lucky. Ah. Uh, that's four o'clock. Not three o'clock. Ah, uh, just oh jizzed in his face. <laughs> when I was a little girl, I, I really like you, Marvin. Right. So the next time you go to visit some really hot former model yeah. who you have some sort of sexual history with and who's in a vulnerable state... I don't think they would have a sexual together. Me. You're right. I can do this. What? Okay, she's, she's sounding reasonable, but I also don't agree. He just heard that... She had a drug problem and went to check if she was okay. I don't know. It wasn't that deep, I guess. I like this pie. It's got a nice vibe going on, actually. Look at everyone. Oh. Hey, junkie. For, for Victoria gives the pie, I was like, like, nice chill vibe, and then Victoria walks in. Why did you think of them before you relapse? Oh my god. And waste all their time and their money. She annoys me so much. Dan was evil, but he was comically evil. She's just a knob. That's going to stare back onto drugs, that little speech. Which is so annoying because I, no, nah. I thought Rachel was gonna. I, it's not happened yet, so maybe I'll hold off. One, two, three. <laughs> nice. <laughs> that was a bit aggressive, to be fair. <laughs> they did slam Duncan. What, bro, Haley? Because I know you and Nathan going through some things right now. Yes. But I never lost sight on how little that boy is. <laughs> Actually, I'm amazed how little he is because his heart is so big. Oh. You know, today, all he wanted to do was make sure y'all was a whole family again. Skills. Oh, man. That's what today meant to him. Uh. I just think y'all the ones that done lost sight of things. Don't, don't look at me. <laughs> oh, he's so good. If Skills is in your favourite character, oh, you're doing it wrong. <laughs> Why do I tear up at Skills? <laughs> I'm the one who's sorry. For changing him from, like, season us. one? No, I'm... Um, now, we... now... I'm done trying. I'm so confused with what she's saying. When did she try and change him? You've both been so dramatic about this. The babysitter kissed Nathan. He should have told you about it. That's it. That's what happened. He didn't kiss the babysitter, so he didn't cheat on her. 
This is... Oh, what the fuck? Hey. Is it dying? Do rabbit's legs shake when it's happy? Please tell me that. You know it, huh? He's a good uh, guy. He's alright. He is. Yeah, yeah, she has more chemistry with Owen than with you, Chase, for sure. Oh, God, they're really, they're going to push these two on, they What an absolute shocker. The moon bounces rocking. Hi. <laughs> is Dan on top of it? Suppose Keith oh. and my dad were sitting next to each other at a bar and <laughs> Like on a stealth mission. My father loved you. Lindsay deserves better than Lucas. Because, oh, lo and behold, like, what's going to happen? He's going to cheat on her, or he's going to just get dumped and get by with Peyton? Millicent, aren't you uh, forgetting something? Millicent? Is that a name? Oh, bro. Thank you. Oh. I don't... No, you know, I've gone on about skills too much, but I'm going to just say I want a friend. I want skills as a friend. All right, Peyton. Never mind then. I thought I thought Payne was chasing Chase's dick, but apparently not. What a letdown. Are you gonna be here in the morning, Daddy? God, Nathan looks like a giant there with his feet. Are you ever coming home, Daddy? For what? Why, Haley? I hope so. I hope so too. <laughs> Jamie's so cute. <laughs> This is bullshit, I'm sorry, what the fuck? Is it just me who thinks this is well dramatic for nothing? Not nothing. Not nothing. Yes, have some words. Gone. And the money's gone. You tried, bro. What? Was I feel so good about myself right now. It's so obvious. <laughs> I can't feel too good about myself because it was well obvious, but... What's your story? Kill my bro. Just got out of prison. I just got out of jail for killing my brother. Right. I mean, first. So did you do it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Straight away, just fucking look at her shit herself. I mean, fair slow. <laughs> yeah. He's not in denial anymore. I'll even tell Cal Pai about it. I'm not saying she looks like a cow, by the way. Pat is what you call cow shit. Pai. I need to clear that up for people start ripping off. A daughter! Is not supposed to have to earn her mother's help or her love. Literally, what is this delusional woman on about? Whatever. Killer. You're fired. Thank you, God. You are fired. You're going to fire me. Yeah. Bye. We risk our entire company. Yeah. But it's not our company. It's my company. Yes, Brock. Remember? Get a plus sign. I am, I am your mother. No, go away. I know. You're fired. Thank you, Brock. Absolute badass. You can go now. She's evil. Go away. Bye. Go back to the old people's home. And you're thrown in a harmonica. After that? Oh yeah. Watching Once Upon a Time in the West, apparently now. What a way to kill that scene it. off. Jesus. That's no unfortunate. Break, no healing. Re edit That's these episodes, healing. someone. Don't get me wrong, harmonicas can sound sick. Like Once Upon a Time in the West, I'll smash it, but. The pain so intense to feel, especially now it added up through the years. Brock, no! <laughs> you can't marry Lindsay. Why? 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 Why though? Haley, fuck off. Haley's annoying me now. Why would you tell him that? Is she just saying that in general, or is there a reason? You can't marry him. Piss off, Haley. Just piss off. Absolute knob. Um. <laughs> I mean, the sad thing is she's right because Lucas is still in love with Peyton, so he's marrying her because he thinks that's what he needs to do, but. He shouldn't. So Hayley is technically right, but it's so annoying because Lindsay's a good person and is nice and deserves way better than this. So this is just shit. Just shit. This whole Lucas Lindsay Payton thing is doing my absolute head in. However, this was the best episode in a long, long time. The last episode was good, and I thought it was like 
I was so nice to have like a really good episode because every other one was just so dire. Not dire, but you know, they were just doing their thing. This has a 76% on tracked. This is the lowest rated episode. How? How? Wait, this might be the lowest rated episode of the season. <laughs> Apart from episode 8, this is the lowest rated episode of the season. I thought it was really good. I guess I'm the odd one out on this one. 76%? What's the fuck? Yeah, every other episode apart from episode 8, which has 75%, which I gave a 5 out of 10 to, so yeah, that's, <laughs> that's about right, to be fair. Um, Dan didn't come back. I thought Dan was going to return uh, to the party, but I guess he didn't want to... He is going to show up at some point, so... Uh, yeah, we'll go through everything I like then because I thought this was a really good episode. I'm confused. The only thing I didn't like the mouth romance, I don't care, we'll get that out of the way. And Victoria, I was going to say, was a negative because I was just saying she, she's more of the same over and over. Dan always was doing the same thing, but he kept it switching up to make it feel refreshing. And he had a, an actual personality. Victoria doesn't have a personality, her personality is mean mom, bitch, twat, knob. That's just like her whole personality. Dan was funny, he was humorous, and then he had an actual storyline involved with pretty much everyone. Uh, but Victoria was more of the same, but I let it off this episode because it built up to the moment of Brooke firing her. If you didn't have everything you had this episode with Victoria, the Brooke firing her wouldn't have had as much of an impact as it did this episode, so I'm going to let that one slide. Mouth does not get a pass, though. Everyone else, really good. Dan coming back, cool. We had Bevin... I put Bevan and Tim had a baby, question mark, because they both said their baby was named Nathan, and it might have been the same picture. So I'm assuming that's what that LinkedIn thing is. I'm assuming we'll never see Bevan and Tim again. It was just kind of them throwing them in to be like, oh, they still exist, just so you know. Which is unfortunate, because I actually kind of like Bevan, but... And Tim was funny, just because he was so ridiculous. Uh, then we had Chase coming back. I like the whole, you know... I... <laughs> I don't like that they're trying to heavily hint up Rook and Chase again already. That's clearly... Because I, I don't like Owen, but I don't mind him. Chase has more of a personality this episode than he did in the entirety of Season 4. <laughs> Maybe a bit harsh. There were a couple of moments where Chase was really good, to be fair. But he seems more likeable in this episode. So we'll see. But I'm surprised. I really thought he was done. I didn't think he was a character they were going to bring back. So I'm not mad about it. Uh, actually, I put it as a plus. So, I mean, there you go. Um, skills, best character of the entire episode. He made me tear up twice just because he's so wholesome. He's so wholesome. I love him so much. His bond with Jamie, he's like, I like that he didn't just take what Haley was putting down. He was like, actually, no, take a look in the mirror for a second, kind of thing. Um, yeah, he's just such a good character. My favorite character of the entire season. And this is one of his. Best episodes, not in terms of story, but just his whole vibe. I, I don't know, some of that, I'm really, he's such a likeable character. Um, so yeah, I really like skills. And the whole party like atmosphere for like the like 15 minutes of this episode where it's just jumping from character to character, like Brooke going in to visit Jamie, and then her just like having cake with Owen and skills playing with Jamie. Uh, then you yeah, like Nathan and Haley trying to talk a bit, and a bit Lindsay and Lucas. Bit of Chase and Peyton, like everything worked really well in the whole party scenario. Um, so I thought that was good. And then Brooke firing her mom, finally. My lord, that was a long time coming. Didn't think, I think Rachel was okay. I thought that was really predictable with her taking the money. Um, and it was because of what Victoria said. Well done. I don't think Rachel actually would have taken the money. I think it was Victoria that pushed her to do that. So I'll give Rachel that at least. Because I thought she was just going to straight up take the money, but she didn't. Um, yeah, I don't, I'm don't. i confused why this has such a low rating. I'm going to go an eight, 8 out of 10. I thought this was the best episode since... <clears throat> episode 4. Episode 1, 4, and now 11 have been the three great episodes of the season. But episode 9, 8... I don't know. It's just a lot of like sevens. We've had a lot of sevens, then nine and eight were fives. So, yeah, it's nice to have an episode like this. I'm assuming people disagree because, like I say, second, second lowest rating episode of the season. 
Probably because they didn't have a lot of Peyton and Lucas. I bet that's the reason why. <laughs> but I'm glad about that. <laughs> Avoid them as much as you can, please. You know, it seems like we're probably going to get to their wedding very soon because this was The Bachelor. So it might even be next episode that we have the big wedding if this was the big bachelor party because they're typically, obviously, the night before. So, um, yeah. I really enjoyed this episode. I'm glad we've got Rachel back. I'm glad we've got Chase back. I'm glad we've got Dan back. It feels like we're bringing these characters back into the mix. Which is, which is a good thing. So yeah, there we go, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know what you thought of the episode down below in the comments. If you want the early, early and uncut STEM Patreon one, of course, be linked down below. And I'll see you next time for episode 12. Until then, take care. Peace.